Hi, welcome to this new video about YubiKey where we will deal with Windows Remote Desktop and how we can use a YubiKey with the Windows Remote Desktop protocol. This question is one of that I received the most and luckily we have a simple answer. Remote Desktop protocol in Windows natively support YubiKey. So for this demo, I'm going to use a remote Windows machine in Azure. It, it is in, in the other part of the globe. We are in Europe. The machine is in United States. So I show you that you only need simple a remote desktop to get started and use your YubiKey inside your remote Windows machine. The option is enabled by default, but if you want to be sure that it is indeed enabled, you need to go to local resources and go to more and be sure that you have selected the smart card or Windows Hello for Business and Web Out and Windows Hello or Security Key. These two options will allow the remote desktop machine, the other part of the connection, to use your local smart card or YubiKey like if it was connected directly to the remote machine. Now I have logged in in remote desktop and I'm in the remote machine and it does not occupy all the area of the screen because I want to show you something. When I press sign in and I choose the sign in option as usual, I can use the sign in with the security key. What happens behind the scene is the Windows security uh, message, it pops up. And if I move this, you can see that it moves outside the windows of the remote desktop. This certify that indeed it's my local operating system that is asking me to connect to my hardware. So the hardware is not really directly connected to the remote machine. It's a feature of the remote desktop protocol that it's able to remotely uh, offer the hello protocol of Windows being able to give to the remote desktop to the other part of the remote desktop connection to ask for your host machine to interact with your key. And the result is I'm pressing my secret pin on my machine. I touch my key and the protocol remotely give access to the cryptographic FIDO2 protocol to login. And I was able to sign in in my Microsoft account in the remote machine that is in the other part of the globe, simply touching my local YubiKey. And this is really good for people using Windows because Remote Desktop Protocol is really widely used to access remote machines. And this concludes this really small video about how you can use your YubiKey with a remote machine using the Remote Desktop Protocol. And that again show you how versatile is logging in with an hardware key with, to have a more secure login, even if you are using remote machines with remote desktop protocol. Seeing you in the next video.